Today I'm doing a video on voltage regulators. This one here is a Triplight LCR2400 by a Triplight, of course, and uh, it's the 2400 model. I usually use this one for my uh, DJ equipment, but I've noticed in the winter time in Montreal, the voltage in my neighborhood anyway goes down to 115 volts from 122 in the summer, and on the weekends it hits as low as 111. So that could be detrimental on my uh, my computer here. So I'm using it for my computer for now, along with the uh, the Furman PST 8D, which is the digital model with SMP. This mo this strip from Furman it it, it, tra it traps spikes and noise, but it doesn't dump it to ground. It dissipates it in heat. So you can then send it in a thousand to thousands of spikes and it won't damage your... or there's no sacrificial parts to the strip. No MOVs to burn out. So it'll always uh, trap the spikes. So the setup here is nice and clean. All the wires and nothing on the floor except for the extensions going to the, uh, the trip light. As you can see here, it's low, which is now it's, it's like a step up transformer built into this. Brings it up to 126. And if you take it in the wall, it's down to 114, 113. So it plays like that for the whole winter. So I know people say it doesn't damage your computer, but over time it will affect your computer microprocessors and everything. I also have a the Furman PST 8 non-digital one for my uh, home cinema. I've got to protect that paradigm PW2200. And I've noticed the picture when when it is kept at 120 to 125 there is a better sound, better picture. Then when I let it go down to 111 directly on the wall sort of see like a shady color in the picture on the, on the monitors on the, on the TV. So I recommend, I mean you can use a UPS if you want to, but it's just too expensive and since I had this one lying around so I just tried it out and uh, it does the job. Mind you the, the trip light's not the best one in the market because the MOVs the conditioning in this unit do not really work anymore because the MOVs have been, I'm sure, used up by the spikes. So that's why I'm using the Furman, the SMP model. No sacrificial parts into the Furman. It's just dissipated into heat. No dumping to ground. That way you get no nothing. No problems with the computer. Protects my three external drives. Yeah, I'm using a strip also for a ta uh, well daisy chain to the Furman because I have no room to put the uh, the wall warts for the external drives. It's a trip light, but like I said, it's hooked up to the uh, Furman. Everything works well. Okay, that's it.